dolls welcome back to the dollhouse if you are new here thank you so much for stopping by i am jay chantel and i create content all about plastic surgery my own personal plastic surgery journey as well as beauty and lifestyle if this is like your second or third video that you've watched like at this point we're together and i need you to fully commit by hitting that subscribe button I am super excited to share this content with you guys. I literally got in from Houston super early this morning and I said, I'm gonna take a nap and I'm gonna get on this right now while it is hot and fresh off the press. I wanna go ahead and jump into today's video, which is of course going to be all about my trip to Houston to celebrate Dr. Jung and his wonderful team in the grand opening of Premier Surgical Arts. So without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy this vlog. I made it! Okay, I was just trying to make sure I could see myself because the sun is blocking me, but I have made it, and I'm super excited. My plans did not go as planned, but I'm here. I got my luggage with me because I literally just came straight from the airport to here. But I'm super excited. I'm on time. I'm actually really early. I'm probably probably the first person here. <laughs> but I wanted to come and get some footage and stuff before it gets too crowded. Look at this beautiful sign. Like, OMG, it is absolutely beautiful. And then this building is humongous. You guys can't see it from here, but it's like huge chandeliers and like this parking space. This entire space is humongous. Like, look at all of this room. Like, oh my goodness. And it's like a full garage um, in the back. Let me see, I haven't went inside yet. I've just been kind of sitting outside like recording, obviously. And so I'm here early. I just got from the airport. I do want to freshen up my makeup. I'm probably not going to change clothes, but you know, today is not about me. Today is about me supporting Dr. Zhang. So they have this like back area like look at this this is huge 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 let's see if dr john has a parking space if he don't have his own parking spot i'm gonna be very surprised i see his car but i don't see i don't see it just says this space is reserved i expected something much more extra oh my god look at this wall it looks just as good as it looked online. This is absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at this Baja. Oh my goodness. So this is Shapewear Land, and I'm not familiar with the like the brand brand, but um, I think that they partnered with John for his Bajas. I'm super early, like it's literally, I need to charge up my phone. It's 4.05, 16.05, and it doesn't start for another 55 minutes. But that's okay, I'd rather be early than like stressed out and late. It's a very like nice space in here so far. So I'm gonna look around a little bit more if I, see anything I'm definitely gonna pull out my camera it is kind of awkward but you know this is the life this is what I do so hey it is what it is and I will be back in a little bit I'm gonna try to freshen up some okay so this is how I'm looking up in this mirror um where is the full body mirror like I need a full body I need y'all to get into this all black slim sleek look that I'm giving straight off the airport look so I'm the first person here as we expected. I'm gonna get some footage and I will be back. Uh, 
We're here at our open house, like 30 minutes early. <laughs> Eager Beaver here, but she's gonna show you what my surgery center looks like. Stay tuned. Thank you. There you go. OMG, oh my gosh. So I just got like the inside scoop on this place. Of course, I told you guys, I'm super early. Um, yeah, this is our place. First of all, this is when you first come to get your surgery. This is where you check in to get your surgery, and this is where your guests wait for you while you get your surgery. I'm gonna have to turn the camera around to give you guys this view. So as you get off the elevator, you are met with this amazing view that looks and feels like a spa. They have a small complimentary coffee area, and then they also have a really nice bathroom there for you and for whoever is waiting for you to come out of surgery, which is much different from the other facility because there is so much more room and you can actually wait inside instead of having to wait outside. I love that this looks and feels like a spa so you don't really feel nervous before your surgery. Now that we are done with the check-in and the welcome area, come with me to the surgery center where all of your pre-op, post-op, and your surgery will actually be performed. Now, straight ahead, you will see the pre-op room where all of your vitals will be taken and all of the prep to get you ready for surgery will be happening. To your immediate right is a private elevator, and straight ahead is the area where all of the registered nurses will be while you recover from surgery and make sure your vitals are doing well. Now we are going to go to the OR, which is my favorite part. Look at this OR. First of all, this is the first one. Look at this. Massive, massive. Huge. This is like a full medical facility. This is Dr. Jung's OR. Look at this. It's absolutely huge and it's so nice and clean. The music box. I know Drake is going to be playing 100%. I remember um, when I was getting ready to have my surgery and I had to walk into the OR, I was so nervous. <laughs> and so scared but this is a different feel like it's definitely still like a medical facility but it doesn't feel as scary which is super important and this is for smaller procedures probably more so like um quicker procedures as well it's like a smaller or and then like I wanted to do a quick voiceover to make sure that I don't miss anything. Straight ahead is the recovery area and there are so many rooms. I didn't count, but it definitely felt like it was like at least 10 in total. It could be less, could be more, but it's so many rooms. That's the area where dolls will be going after they have surgery to be monitored by RNs and making sure that they're recovering well from surgery before they get released. And that area right there is for the nurses where they will be monitoring the dolls. And as you can see, it definitely has a hospital look and feel. Very high tech, very professional. I absolutely love it. And as you go around, you see the wheelchairs where if you've had surgery, you know all about those wheelchairs. After you have your surgery and after you get monitored, you will go ahead and get into a wheelchair. And at that point, you'll either be getting a massage by their in-house masseuse, which is Yasmir, or you'll be going all the way down to the first floor to get picked up by your loved one or the recovery home. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe how nice this facility is, mind you. I have never been in like a surgery center like this before of this magnitude, but man, it is so nice. And it's definitely gonna be huge. And um, he talked about being able to have other surgeons working out of here too. So of course, you know, Dr. Shimada is gonna be here, but other, maybe another surgeon too, another junk protege, I don't know. But 
I know that it's more than enough space and it's gonna be more than enough dolls to fill up this space for sure. So let me get some more footage and I will be back. So the second floor is home to the med spa. When I tell you that those rooms are so fancy, so beautiful, and definitely on brand. I love those elegant pictures that they have posted on the wall, and the vibes are just vibing. It is so beautiful. So the med spa does fillers, Botox, facial contouring, and threads, and it was such a pleasure meeting Sabrina. That night at the grand opening, they were offering consultations for free, which they're not free. Uh, so it was a very nice touch. I actually had a consult as well with Sabrina, and it was a great experience overall. I definitely will be looking into them once I decide to get a little bit of Botox. So, yes. You want to say hi? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. video for you guys so that you guys can see exactly how much footage I got and how beautiful this building is. 
Once again, congratulations to Dr. Zhang and also to Sabrina and Vanessa and Dr. Shamada and all the other providers that are at Dr. Zhang's office. I'm wishing you guys the very, very best. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog and just watching this video in general. I tried to make it not too long, but there were definitely points that I wanted to make sure that you guys didn't miss out on. I just want to say congratulations again, Dr. Zhang, if you watch this video. Congratulations again to you and your team, all five providers that are a part of your team. I want to shout out uh, Katie, who I had a chance to chat with. She's a part of Dr. Zhang's team. She's the head of social media. And it was so nice to meet you, Katie. And I really, really enjoy your vibes. Like, we can go get drinks one day and just kiki because, like, you're that cool. And I really appreciated seeing Sabrina as well. I never saw her in person before. And when I tell you she is just as gorgeous in person as she is like on social media, I was stunned. I'm super excited for you guys and I'm, I feel blessed to have been a part of such a huge moment in your career. So thank you for inviting the public out so that we can join and celebrating you. Um, I'm super grateful and I hope to see you again soon and the rest of your team. Bye guys, stay tuned for the next video.